sleeping Clifton. Fill the tank up again there. Going to go with I'm going to squirt about these roads here <laughs> in amongst the hills of Connemara. I just love this part of the country. Two wheels or four. up on our left there, 12 bends or 12 hunts, those 12 peaks, nice drive through there. Not the leg. Look at that. Love over around Galway City, this would be your Sunday runabout out this way, wouldn't it? Donegal School Day. From our part of the country, going on the Donegal, and they show West Donegal, or up around the North Coast. Quite lucky in this cover. If you only had more of the dry weather.
Đấy cái đường ấy Have you considered the speed limit? You mm. suck it all in. Good job, pretty well, eh? Well, let's get free. Dark all of a sudden. Temperatures have plummeted to 12 and a half degrees. Then you can feel it. We started off this morning, it was 16. And that certainly wasn't forecast there, it was to be clear. Blue sky. Look at that out over there as you go over towards Galway. Not liking that. <coughs> Guys are still clear behind us. We seem to be getting under there. Put a bad roller. I have no web gear. Hack light. Right here, at the Bentley Ross Muck Hill. Really good cold. It's only 11 and a half degrees. A big change. Very overcast. Certainly wasn't that forecast. Please don't say it. West coast of Ireland, as you can get here, this is it. My legs freeze. Patrick Pierce's cottage is down around here somewhere, and there's something like that there. I think I would be signposted if I'm confident. 
sounds not eight years ago. That's what I was trying to say. So we used to holiday here in the Caravan Gale Pack. As they will tell you. He was here towards the end of 1915. Or whatever date it was, 1915. And he was sent for to come back to Dublin to give a ration at O'Donovan Ross's funeral. But he was never back here again then because events took over. And he was one of the leaders of the 1916 Rising, and he was executed. Headmaster of St. Andrews College. Well, this is Pierce's College, not that. That's a new visitor center. The cottage is up behind. That visitor center. <coughs> So we built in recent years, it's a long time since I've been here. And you can walk up the cottage, but I'm just too lazy today. So go back there somewhere. See it up there with a flag flying on the trees, something there. They just couldn't be fitted today. That was a bit of a damp squib. We sat there all closed up due to the COVID restrictions. 